World record setting reef will soon be sunk in the Gulf of Mexico. It was built here in South Mississippi and partially funded through a local pest company. Look at that behind us. Well, Noah Noble explains what it's all about. This boat behind me will soon be the latest reef to be home to hundreds of species of Gulf of Mexico fish. But it's not the boat that makes it interesting, it's that thing. You're looking at a 70-foot cockroach on top of a 150-foot Mississippi River tugboat. It's all welded steel, and, mm -hmm. and so it's permanently built. It's welded to the tugboat. Bay Pest Control owner Bruno <laughs> Milanese commissioned the potentially world record setting reef. I decided if I was gonna get involved in it, it was gonna be very, very interesting. So we decided to create the world's largest cockroach and make it a the world's only cockroach reef. The tugboat will be towed around 20 miles south of Pascagoula and sunk down 90 feet to the sea floor. It's a pretty wild project. Uh, never done one just like this before, but I, I have uh, sunk many vessels in the, the northern Gulf in special reef zones to help uh, rehabilitate the marine environment and all of the reef species and many other species. Will Ladnier owns Gulfstream Marine. He partnered with DMR and Mississippi Fishing Banks to make the project happen. And while it takes a lot of labor to make a vessel reef worthy, the impacts are well worth the hours of sweat. It's unbelievable. I mean, we can't, I can't hardly describe it here right now. You have to see some of the studies to show how much food this produces for our country. And, and behind all the fun and the joking of the giant cockroach, it's really serious business uh, that NOAA is involved in and many agencies to keep our country in a position to feed itself. Indy Iberville, NOAA Noble, WLOX News Now.